Hey, what's going on guys? It is Lastly here and welcome today to a bit of a squad builder featuring two of my favourite players on this game. Inform Depay and Inform Chikawi. Two awesome five-star skillers that we have had the pleasure of them being in Team of the Week and the Team of the Tournament for the African Cup of Nations. First off, if you guys are looking for any Ultimate Team Coins, check out the FIFA shop.co.uk. Use my code LA5TY, that'll get you a 10% discount. Links down below in the description. If you could smash that like button on this video, I'd really appreciate it. That'd be absolutely awesome. Let's hit 2,000 likes. So in goal, we've got Hugo Lloris. One of the better keepers on this game. 85 rated. He's got cat-like reflexes. He's an absolute god, uh, even though keepers are, in general, pretty terrible. Our defense looks like this. We've got uh, Abate at right back, who is my second favorite right back on this game. Uh, Dennis Diekmeyer, or Dijkmeyer, is my favorite. We've got Van Aanhal at left back, who's slowly making his way to the top of my list of favorite left backs, because he's got so much pace. And he's actually a really good defender as well. We've got Vincent Company at center back. 86 rated, rock solid guy. You know, he's like your captain of the team. Six foot four with 87 defending. And his teammate Mangala um, has got a lot of pace. And the high, high work rates do not seem to affect him too much, especially with the player instructions and all of that good stuff. Uh, the high the high attacking work rates on center backs nowadays is not such a big thing. In, not in my opinion, anyway. Our midfield is pretty decent. It looks like this. We've got Wijnaldum at center mid. Normally, you would see him a lot further up the pitch, but he does a good job at CM because he's got really good, well-rounded stats. You know, 63 defending on a centre mid is actually not too bad at all. We've got Chermiti at centre attacking mid. He is going to be the chemistry bitch, of course, for Chikawi. But he's actually a really good player. He's an assist king. He's got nine assists for me and also three goals as well. Really solid player. I like him a lot. Uh, and then Pogba as our final centre midfielder. He doesn't actually get too, much, uh, too involved with the goals and the assists playing back in centre mid like this. But he's a really good... He acts kind of like your CDM and he's one of those overpowered players on FIFA. Now, this is my strike force. It's pretty epic, I've got to say. It's one of the most fun teams I've used in a long time. We've got Niang with his AC Milan card as our right winger. Now, he's got four-star skills and weak foot. He's also six foot tall, and I get on really well with this guy. Such a tricky player. Really quick with lots of great uh, dribbling as well for a silver anyway. Memphis Depay is a goal-scoring king. He's a set-piece king. He will score you penalties, free kicks, and also some skill goals as well. What a god he is. Followed by this man, one of the best strikers on Ultimate Team. He is absolutely incredible. I paid 67k and I was I thought that was really cheap. He's like half that right now. Absolute god with 85 pace and 88 dribbling on a 77 rated card. He's got five star skills and weak foot. It's just godly. This team in general is going to cost you around sort of 350k, maybe a little bit more than that, 375. Um, depending on the players' prices at the times, prices are sort of all over the place as you guys know at the moment. Now with this team. It was pretty much all about the front three. Um, Niang, Dipe, and also Chikawi. They were the goal scorers for me. And I've got to say, they did quite a good job at it. Like, we scored a lot of goals. I had a lot of people rage quit at me at 2-0, which is a bit a bit frustrating. I don't like when people do that. Um, but Chimiti, Wijnaldum, Pogba, all of those players were... They supplied the goals. That's a great strike, by the way, from Niang. I love the technique that he hit that. And I really like that it hit off the inside of the post as well. Absolute great. It kind of reminds me of the goal Daniel Sturridge scored the other day. Let me know down below if that reminds you of that as well. Now, we're moving on to the goals that we scored with Memphis Depay. I told you he was a bit of a set-piece king. He scored two penalties for me because he's got pretty good stats. Lots of shot power and all of that good stuff. He's also great at making great runs on the ball. Like, he's uh, he's really quick and he makes some nice runs and gets into good positions. Like, right there, he just runs straight into the back post. An easy ball through to him and he's going to score it. He also scored me like a header right here. Wasn't expecting that, but we'll take it anyway. Uh, but the, the main thing... I'm really impressed with is his free kicks. He scores one. Uh, then we move on to the next clip. He scores another. This guy moved his wall slightly, which enabled me to score that low driven shot right there. And then this one, 38 yarder absolute banger in off the post of the keeper whatever happened right there it was still one of the nicest free kicks I've scored I believe it goes off the bar or the post onto the goalkeeper and fortunately enough for me it goes into the back of the net what a lovely uh, lucky goal that one was right there and then if you guys know how to use Chikawi and that is just with complete and utter brute force you're gonna love him he uh, he makes again like to pay he makes some great runs and his ability to finish on either foot is phenomenal it's one 
one of he's one of the best cards I've used on FIFA this year. You know how I say that legends seem to outperform their card stats? Chikawi's one that does that. He's not a legend, of course, but he almost plays like one. It's really crazy how people do not know how to defend this guy. Simply, I mean, I'm the same. I've come up against him before, and I've been wrecked by the guy. But the fact that he's got the five-star skills and weak foot, you don't know which way he's going to turn. You don't know which way he's going to skill, uh, because he can go either way and then score on either foot. It's crazy. He's got a lot of physical presence as well. And then this is the nicest goal that I scored with him. A little turn, like a really cool turn header thing. I've never scored one of them and I thought it looked absolutely awesome so I'm going to show it to you a couple of times really nice guy if you could smash that like button that'd be absolutely amazing show me a picture on Twitter if you decide to build this squad at lasty thanks for watching I'll catch you next time peace